Hello everyone, in this video we are going to learn how to find HCF by using the Euclid's division algorithm. According to Euclid's division algorithm, we can express dividend as the product of divisor and quotient plus remainder. This is very easy to understand. So let's see a division problem 57 divided by 8 is equal to 7 with remainder of 1. So this division problem can be expressed in terms of Euclid's division algorithm. So according to Euclid's division algorithm, dividend which is the number to be divided which is 57 is equal to divisor which is the number which is dividing the dividend which is 8 here times quotient, quotient is 7 plus remainder which is 1. So we can see that 57 is equal to 8 times 7 plus 1. So this is the Euclid's division algorithm. So this is all about dividend, divisor, quotient and remainder. Now we come back to finding the HCF using this algorithm. Let us take two numbers whose HCF we need to find out. Find the HCF of let's say C and D. So when we apply Euclid's division algorithm to C and D, we'll have two numbers Q and R such that C is equal to D times Q plus R. Remainder is less than D and greater than 0. And if R is equal to 0, then D is the HCF of C and D. So this is how we find the HCF using the Euclid's lemma. We keep on dividing the bigger number with a smaller number until we get the remainder as 0. So let's start with finding the HCF of 135 and 225 using Euclid's algorithm. So for finding the HCF, first we'll check which number is bigger. So here we see that 225 is greater than 135. We'll divide 225, the bigger number, by 135. So 135 times 2 will be more than 225. So we'll go with 135 times 1 is 135. Subtract the two numbers 5 minus 5 0 2 minus 3 is not possible So we will take a borrow from here This will become 12 12 minus 3 is 9 So we can write 225 as 135 times 1 plus 90 90 is our remainder here So we keep on dividing the number Until we get the remainder as 0 so now this remainder will act as a divisor and the new dividend will be 135. So we will divide 135 by this 90. Let's divide it. So 90 times 1 is 90. We will subtract the two numbers. This is 5 and 13 minus 9 is 4. So now we have another expression. 135 is equal to 90 times 1 plus 45. So one remainder now is 45. We have to divide until we get the remainder as 0. Now 45 will be our new divisor and the dividend will be the previous divisor. So we will divide 90 by 45. So 45 times 2 is 90. So our remainder is now 0. So we can write 90 is equal to 45 times 2 plus 0. So the divisor by which we are getting the remainder as 0 will be the HCF of the two numbers 135 and 225. So our final answer will be the HCF of 135 and 225 is 45. Let's solve our second example. So in the second example too, we are going to start by take checking which number is bigger. Here 38,220 is bigger than 196. So we'll divide 38,220 by 196. 
तो 196 times 1 is 196. Subtract the two numbers. 12 minus 6 is 6. This becomes 7. 17 minus 9 is 8. And this is 2. 2 minus 1 is 1. Now we'll drop down the next number which is 2. 196 times 9 is 1764. We'll subtract the two numbers. 2 minus 4 is not possible. So we'll borrow from here. This will become 7. This is 16. 16 minus 1 will be 15. And this is 12. So 12 minus 4 is 8. 15 minus 6 is 9. And 7 minus 7 is 0. And 1 minus 1 is 0. Now we'll drop down the next number which is 0. So 196 times 5 is 980. So we can write 38,220 as 196 times 195 plus 0. So the divisor by which we are getting the remainder as 0 will be the HCF of the two numbers. So the HCF of 38,220 and 196 is 196. Let us solve our final and last example and find the HCF of 867 and 255. As obvious, 867 is greater than 255. So we'll divide 867 by 255. So this will go like three times. 255 times 3 will be 765. Subtract the two numbers. So 7 minus 5 is 2, 6 minus 6 is 0 and 8 minus 7 is 1. 102 is the remainder here. So we can write 867 as 255 times 3 plus 102. This is our remainder. As remainder is not 0, so we are going to divide 255. So 255 divided by 102 will be, let's try 2 times. 102 times 2 is 204. Subtract the two numbers. 5 minus 4 is 1 and 5 minus 0 is 5 and 2 minus 2 is 0. So our new remainder is 51. And we can write 255 as 102 times 2 plus 51. Again, our remainder is not 0. We are going to divide 102 by 51. So 51 times 2 is 102. And our remainder is 0. So we can write 102 as 51 times 2 plus 0. So the divisor by which we got the remainder as 0 it will be the HCF of the two numbers. So the HCF of 867 and 255 is 51. So this is how you can use Euclid's division algorithm for finding the HCF of large numbers. I hope this video is helpful to you. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.